It's a smartphone for those who put secure communications above all. We had a look at it in Barcelona back in February, and now we're going hands-on in the Pocket Now review booth. I'm Michael Fisher with Pocket Now. Join us as we unbox Black Phone, the handheld that looks to take mobile privacy to the next level. Our review unit comes to us from our friends at GSM Nation, a premium smartphone retailer and wholesaler. If you want a black phone of your own, do what we did. Visit gsmnation.com and tell them Pocket Now sent you. If a device calls itself the black phone, you can probably assume it's going to come in a black box. No disappointments there, and thankfully it's not the indestructible type. Cutting the security seal gets us a fairly standard unboxing experience, once we get past the cardboard top layer, anyway. The phone itself is wrapped in a soft plastic envelope that protects it from damage and also heightens the mystery. Underneath it is the usual bevy of inbox accessories, including documentation, a battery with a slightly concerning 2000 mAh capacity, a data cable and various charging adapters, and finally, something we're always grateful to see, a set of earbuds that look very fancy indeed. Pulling the black phone from its recyclable pouch, we're struck by how completely nondescript it is. Besides the logo on the backside, there's nothing on this hardware of any note whatsoever. And even after we pop in the battery and snap the cover back in place, it's incredible just how light the device feels. We'll withhold judgment on this for now and content ourselves with peeling the screen protector in the hoity-toity way to which you're accustomed. Quiet, please. Powering on the black phone for the first time gives us a prompt to choose an unlock pin, and then an invitation to encrypt our data. Now, this is not just a throwaway security buzz phrase. It's a long process that takes up to an hour to complete. You have to plug the device in using the top-mounted USB port, which is kind of awkward, but it's not the first time we've seen a power port up there. But once encryption is finished, you're welcomed to a phone that looks suspiciously like stock Android, but in place of the usual Google apps, there's a suite of pre-installed titles from Silent Circle, and it immediately puts you to work choosing and entering passwords to jumpstart your new life of private mobile communications. How well does it all work? We'll see in our Black Phone review coming soon. And stay tuned also for details on a special Black Phone giveaway. Till then, let us know down in the comments what you want covered in the full review, and tune into the Pocket Now Weekly podcast Friday, August 8th, where we'll have this very black phone live on the air, and we'll be taking your questions about it. Till next time, this has been Michael Fisher with Pocket Now, Captain Two Phones on Twitter. Thanks again to GSM Nation for the black phone review unit. Follow us and them on social media and in the links down below next to the like button. Most importantly, thanks for watching. We'll catch you next time.